In this series, we're looking at updates to features and tools in the Blackboard Ultra course view. We'll be showing some updates to the course assessments, how to create, edit, and reuse them. Let's start with a brief recap of how to utilize tests, surveys, and pools in Blackboard Original Course View. To use tests in the content area, click on the assessments menu and click test. We click the create button. We fill out the information for the test, the name, description, and instructions, and then click submit. We can build this test out by creating or reusing or uploading questions. Now let's jump over to ultra course view. To add a test to the course content, we click the add content button, choose create, and then from the panel that appears at the right, we'll choose test. You may notice right away that the way that you create tests, edit them and access them later on is much more unified in ultra. Let's go ahead and click the add content button. And we can of course add a variety of different question types. We can add text, add local file, or we can upload questions from a file. The file format used to import is the same as the file format used to import test questions in Blackboard Original. We'll go ahead and give this test a name and we'll click test settings. Set the due date and choose various settings similar to how we did in Original. Prohibit late submissions, allow class conversations, and then we can select whether it's a formative assessment or not. And then we can also adjust the grading settings. Choose the category for grading, attempts allowed, and we can enter the point. Much of what you may recall seeing in the question settings uh, in Blackboard Original now is accessible directly within this scrolling panel. Once we're ready, we'll click save, and then we'll start adding questions. Once we're ready, we'll click save. And now our first question has been added to the quiz. Note the visibility setting from the visibility dropdown. You may also want to reuse questions. To reuse a question, click on the add content button, then click reuse questions. To use the reuse questions page, you can set up your filter criteria on the left side then choose from the questions and items that appear in the active filter area. When you're ready to copy the questions, click copy questions. And you'll see that quiz number one has been added to the course content area. Many instructors like to back up copies of the quizzes and the tests and assessments that they make. In Ultra, to do this, what you'll need to do is use the export course package tool export the course package and then once the package has been exported you can click on the file to download the package this can then be imported by going to import content and choosing import course content and then selecting the file you can learn more about course copying in the course copy video in this series as always if you have any questions about any of this information feel free to reach out to the ELS ID team. And we hope you enjoy the rest of the videos in the Blackboard Ultra Crosswalk series for faculty.